hope you're proud of yourself. Oh, stop blaming Gerald, Bob. You're the one who couldn't admit you were wrong. That's why we're in here, chained together in the toilet of a cat house. <laughs> well, at least these handcuffs are fur-lined. That's kind of nice. <laughs> I can't believe this. All I wanted to do was go camping. Just camping. Dad, how come we can't go on a fishing trip with you and Barry? Because, Jack, this is not going to be another one of our cushy family trips. This is a weekend out in the wilderness. Two grown men in the elements, roughing it. Mm -hmm. Bo, you got that blender? There you go. Thanks, buddy. Just put it in that box right there. Don't scratch that TV. <laughs> Looks like I got everything. Hey, Dad, where's their fishing holes? And that is why you have a second kid. <laughs> that is why you're not taking my video games. <laughs> hey, hon. Hey. What's all this? Me and Barry are going fishing this weekend. No, sweetie, that's next weekend. No, it's not. It's this weekend. No, it's next weekend. I put it out on my calendar. Are you talking about the calendar that Bo made with two Julys? No, my calendar is not wrong, okay? I called the babysitter and I set her up for tomorrow night so we can finally go see a movie, remember? Yeah, well, call the babysitter and make it for next weekend, the right weekend. Okay, fine. I'll reschedule the babysitter for next weekend to see the movie because I'm wrong and you're right. Don't say it to me like that, like you're just allowing me to be right, because I'm right mm -hmm. and I'll prove it mm -hmm. to you. Martin Construction. Hey, Bear. You ready to go fishing? Fishing? That's not till next weekend. <laughs> Jeannie got you a camping shower, huh? <laughs> well, bring it with you. Look, buddy, I don't know what kind of a hole you've dug for yourself over there, but I am not going fishing this weekend. <laughs> Barry, of course I remember all the favors I've done for you over the years. <laughs> What's that got to do with fishing? <laughs> Talk to okay, me. buddy, I'll see you in a minute. No, put her on. What? <laughs> he, uh, he's getting some bait together. His hands were warming. Uh -huh. Oh, hey, guys. Hey. 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 Charlie and I have an exciting announcement to make. As of 0700 hours this morning, we've decided to take our relationship to the next level. Well, you started by sleeping together. What could the next level possibly be? <laughs> I have agreed to be seen with Gerald Bob in public <laughs> on weekends. Huh. You know, most people run the bases in the other direction. <laughs> yeah, I finally wore it down. I'm like that bird disease, infectious and incurable. <laughs> Gerald Bob, you should give yourself more credit. You're like a lot of diseases. <laughs> Rodney, lay off. It's okay, Buttercup. Well, I should get going. Time to make the streets of Tulsa a little safer. <laughs> Well, bye, Sickle. Oh, me. Admit it, Charlie. The government gives you cash back for dating him, don't they? Rodney, now that Gerald, Bob, and I are a two-day week item, I would greatly appreciate it if you showed him just a little respect. Come on, Charlie. I'm just playing with him. I'm going to go load the truck. Okay. Have fun camping on the wrong weekend. Have fun writing stuff down on the wrong date. What is going on with you? I've never seen you stand up for Gerald Bob. Well, you know, people change. Mm. You want a beer? Uh, no. Oh my God, you're pregnant. <laughs> no, I am not pregnant. I might be pregnant. <laughs> and I will find out as soon as I return these whitening strips and get that pregnancy test I meant to buy. Trina marked it down for next weekend. I marked it down for next weekend. And now we're out here looking for a place to pitch our tent because the campground manager had it down for next weekend. Now, isn't it possible, just possible, that you got the date wrong? Isn't it possible, just possible, that you're starting to sound like a woman? Are we anywhere near the lake? Well, how should I know? It's pitch black out here because the clouds are in front of the moon because it's supposed to rain tonight. It's not going to rain. It must be exhausting being right all the time. You know what, Barry? We planned this trip a month ago. Three weeks. You know what? We're going to have some drinks, we're going to relax, and we're going to watch the Cardinals-Astros game. That's next weekend. Whatever! Whatever, Barry! Take the blender, plug it in, make some margaritas. 
I'm gonna hike down to the truck, start the generator up. What the hell? Somebody got the truck, Barry! Slow down, I can't see anything! <laughs> Somebody stole my generator. Forget your generator, somebody stole my truck. <laughs> the only reason they stole your truck was to get to my generator. Barry, that truck was a classic. Just because you had an accident one time with a Model T does not make your truck a classic. I'm not getting any reception. Well, the sheriff department's a few miles that way. I guess we're walking. Oh, good. Look, it's starting to not rain. setback. All right, let's think about this, shall we? I've lost my generator and half my camping gear. I just slogged three miles through the rain and now I got a blister on my heel the size of a quarter. I'm telling you what, buddy, I'm about this close to missing my wife. 